It, the gyrations are, are, are confusing, to say the least, as I mentioned. Um, to taper or not to taper, I guess, or when that's going to come. Um, what's, your, what's your overall take on this? Well, I think yesterday the, the news was very positive for, for the taper argument. The, the, sharp, the plunge in jobless claims and the rise in the inflation rate made it much more likely that they're going to taper, which should have supported the dollar. So the big question is, why did the dollar collapse? I think it probably had a lot to do with the capital flows figures, which showed a huge outflow, another huge outflow of portfolio flows from America. It seems to me that people are waiting until after taper, to after the mm -hmm. tapering has started, to move money into the U.S. And ahead of that, they're, they're taking their money home, and I think that's really upset some calculations. Well, I mean, with, with the taper as a backdrop, and, and, and the, 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 say, say the certainty of a taper coming, and, and U.S. yields at these levels, um, should we be going long dollar on this weakness? Well, yes. I mean, that's a very good point. With U.S. yields rising so much, it should enhance the, the attractiveness of, of the dollar. I think people are just waiting until the yields have peaked, and then they'll go in and buy the cheap, cheap treasuries. Right now, they're selling the treasuries, and that's why the yields are going up. So, so how high are these yields going to go? Uh, I think that... I personally expect the taper to be very gradual. And by the way, taper means taper means buying less. It doesn't <laughs> right. mean buying none, and it certainly doesn't mean selling. So I think that, that uh, Treasuries are actually beginning to look a little oversold at these, this point. All right. Uh, so what are your targets for the, uh, for the greenback at the end of the year? For, okay, for so your, for cable and euro dollar. For, for cable, I think cable is is a, a sell. Okay. I think I think the people have, have misunderstood the, the Bank of England's resolution to get real interest rates lower. The cable is very sensitive to real interest rate differentials. I think it's going down. I would say 145 or lower or lower than that. For euro dollar, it's just been in, the, in this range. I think we'll have to wait till after the German elections, after the, the uh, German court decision, and then I think we could see a break lower down to 125. Let's talk in a little bit more detail about, about Carney and, and, and Draghi's plans uh, and, and what, what, what we can expect. Um, are they going to be forced to make their cases more strongly, do you think? Oh, yes. Yes, I think, as, as Paul Krugman said, central banks have to credibly promise to be irresponsible. 